Aquaponics versus Hydroponics What's the difference between aquaponics and hydroponics? It's a frequent question. Both systems grow food in water after all. Aquaponics offers something more though. A system for breeding freshwater fish is added to the classic hydroponics section. The inspiration comes from the natural cycles of nature, where animals have always provided nourishment for plants and plants for animals. What is hydroponics? Hydroponics is growing plants without soil directly in a nutritious solution. All hydroponics farms look very similar. Large greenhouses with plants planted in mediums usually made of coconut coir. Nourishment is provided by drip irrigation, which is mixed in an exact ratio of fertilizer, based on whether you want to support the growth of the plant or the size of its fruit. Different chemicals are added to the fertilizer, such as phytohormones. The mixture continually flows through the root system of the plants, they draw from it the necessary substances. At the end of the process, a highly concentrated toxic solution of artificial fertilizers the plants didn't absorb is left. This, along with the growth medium, must be disposed of as dangerous waste. Even though hydroponics is simple in operation, the impact on the quality of products and environment isn't as great. What is aquaponics? Aquaponics is a little more complicated than hydroponics. It combines breeding freshwater fish with growing plants in water. It's a completely closed cycle, where the feces of the raised fish are transformed with the help of bacteria and the filtration systems into a nutritious solution. This serves as a natural fertilizer for the grown plants. Plants in the aquaponic system create a dense system of root capillaries that effectively clean the nutritious solution and return it in the form of water back into the wok with the fish. Last but not least, aquaponics has two products – plants and fish. Large aquaponics farms can be indoors in halls or greenhouses. Most of them are the indoor type. This allows us to eliminate the undesirable impact of the weather mold and other pests. The plants are grown vertically on multiple levels, which allows us to grow eight times the amount of what a regular farmer could grow on one square meter. Aquaponics can also be used to grow seasonal vegetables outside. From hydroponics to aquaponics, you can turn a hydroponics farm into an aquaponics farm by adding fish. It's necessary to keep the right ratio of fish to grown plants in order to maintain the correct proportion of nutrients. The waste products, which the fish excrete, are toxic to them. But for the plants, they are a life-giving fertilizer. A surplus of fish in the aquaponic system can result in their death by poisoning. A shortage of fish and fertilizer results in slower growth or withering of the plants. Achieving balance is the most important thing in aquaponics. Aquaponics versus hydroponics. Differences? The basic difference is the source of the nutrients for the plants. While hydroponics uses artificial fertilizers, aquaponics uses the natural feces of the fish. And that is the advantage of aquaponics. The plants are provided with a high-quality non-chemical fertilizing solution that the roots accept better and that contains many more macro and micro elements than the hydroponic solution. Aquaponic systems save considerable amounts of water. During standard operation of a farm, the water in the aquaponic system doesn't have to be changed at all. The only water that is released from the system is the water that naturally evaporates, which is another big difference between aquaponics and hydroponics. Aquaponics is environment-friendly. We grow plants on aquaponics farms close to cities and towns. We are trying to support interest in local food and minimize our ecological footprint. In comparison with traditional farming, aquaponic systems consume up to 95% less water. And in these times when we are confronted by increasing droughts, that is essential. Approximately two-thirds of the sources of drinkable fresh water are being used today to irrigate crops grown by traditional farming. We enrich the atmosphere surrounding the plants with carbon dioxide. In this way, we actively contribute to the decrease of emissions and the fight against climate change. Aquaponics positively impacts the environment. It doesn't produce waste, it doesn't use agrochemicals, it doesn't burn fossil fuels and it doesn't burden the planet with transportation or chemical contamination. Aquaponics products are purely natural. Taste the difference. Dry vegetables and fish in the cleanest form possible from our aquaponics farms.